Hey guys, Erica here, Scrapdiva29. Welcome back to my channel. I am coming on today because I am doing a flash challenge and the flash challenge is Christmas in a Flash with Lady Cree. Her channel is Fun Creations here on YouTube. Of course, I will link her channel in the description box below. Um, but her theme for this week was to create a Christmas project and you had to use ribbon. So this is the ribbon that I chose right here, this really pretty ribbon that I purchased from Michaels um, last year. I used this gable box die from Momenta, picked this up from Hobby Lobby, I believe last year. I used this scalloped um, stitch die, and I believe this is a Gina Marie Designs die. I used this scalloped stitch heart that I got off AliExpress, and then I also used this scalloped lacy rectangle die that I purchased off of AliExpress. And then I used this wonky stitch die that you can get at Cat Scrappiness. I also used um, this bow die, and it's the MFT Dainty Bow Die. And then the paper that I used was this Die Cuts with a View Winter in the Wood Stack. And this is a really pretty pad, and I picked this up at Joann's, I believe, last year. I don't know, I've had it in my stash for a while and I wanted to play with it. Um, this was a challenge for me because I've been working on a lot of Halloween stuff, too, so for me to shift gears and do Christmas was a little challenge, but I was um, inspired um, from some posts that I had been seeing on Instagram, so let me just share with you what I made. All right, so I decided to make a gable box, and this is what it looks like, and I think it came out adorable. Here I have the beautiful ribbon, and I even used some gold twine. Um, this is a little tag that's in the um, paper stack that I die cut out, and then I layered it with this um, scalloped um, circle die. I don't know if I shared that one. I used a lot of dies. Um, and then here you can see that re uh, lacy rectangle square. It's layered a couple of times, and I used the stitched heart, and then that really cute uh, My Favorite Things bow. And I really like the way my gift box came out. Really, really cute. And you can see it has deer on the paper. And it's really, really pretty. So I'm really happy with the way that turned out. I did um, layer the bottom and also the inside just to give the um, gable box um, a sturdy feel. So um, in case you're wondering. And I haven't put anything in it yet. I'll have to undo it to put a little goodie in there, but at least I have one little treat box now made for Christmas. So there's that. And then I made a coordinating card to go along with it. And as you can see, I used the bigger uh, MFT die and backed it with the pretty uh, ribbon. And then I kind of just um, popped the ribbon up a little bit and used some hot glue so it would kind of just stay like that. And then here on the bottom, I used a flower punch that I had in my stash and layered it with some tiny flat back pearls that I picked up from Michaels, probably in their dollar section last year sometime. I'm so missing that dollar section, aren't you guys? They, did, I guess they decided to do away with that little section. But anyway, that's where I picked up the little um, centers. And I think it came out really, really pretty. And it goes with the box. And then this is the inside of the card. I layered it with some pattern paper because this um, paper stack actually comes with A2 size cards that you can cut apart and it's kind of thin. So I went ahead and backed it with some more deco paper and then that wonky stitch bow is on the inside. And then I used a snowflake punch, which is the Martha Stewart punch, and layered a couple of snowflakes and popped up a couple of, um, of those pearl uh, blings from Michaels. And that's the way the inside of the card looks. Really pretty. And this is the back and I stamped out Handmade with Love, and that is a stamp that I had purchased from the Target Dollar Spot. So this is my quick little project share for Christmas in a Flash with Lady Cree, if you wanna participate. Um, I'll leave the channel link below, and that's all I have for today. Thanks for watching, leave me a comment, and I will see you in my next video. Bye for now.